Okay, here we are again with the urban and suburban organic farm for people with limited space, very limited space and bad soil. We have returned again for an update. All right. What's that? Is a jet flying overhead? Either leaving Newark Liberty International Airport or landing, either one. The wind chimes are not chiming because there's no wind right now. Okay, and here we have the front side of the Thai basil. All right, as you can see, it's in bloom and the seeds are almost ready. Okay, the Italian Roma green beans are doing okay for the first year and there's the uh, the sweet uh, Carmen red peppers followed by the cayenne hot pepper <clears throat> it's getting tall and the red <clears throat> the plastic red pot there's some green ones but I'll show you some of the ones that are getting red and uh, here we have the Asian actually Japanese eggplant called Ichiban I had to tie it because I had to tie it because the uh, weight of the branches were too heavy and they were drooping down so low I would I was afraid they would break okay and I have, uh, I have more over here all right there's another one okay and then there's another little one soon to be large one again that fetus shape that they tend to make when they first emerge from the blossom All right. so I don't know it's amazing how many eggplant I've picked so far huh. okay we got some cayenne peppers loaded with it. There's another green one, followed by some young ones that are still green, followed by more. Okay. And here are some red ones ready to be picked. Cayenne pepper. I guarantee the most medicinal of all peppers and one of the most medicinal of all fruits or veggies, whatever you want to call them, herbs. Okay, this one is big, ready to be picked soon. Beautiful color and that's what they all become. All right. Cayenne pepper, I guarantee. Very medicinal. And here we have the Carmens. These are the underdeveloped ones. The red sweet pepper called Carmen. I don't know why they get like this, but they do. And uh, this one is still turning red. This one is developing into a normal pepper shape. Okay, and then we have a, I don't know if you can see, it's not red yet, but it's a big one here. Hold on. Hold on. It's hard to see. There's one over here. It's starting to turn red. That's a large one. Ooh, mosquitoes are attacking. I better get in. And there's the other side of the Thai basil. What I'm going to do is I'm going to, when the seeds are brown, I'm going to just save them and replant them. Very flavorful and aromatic basil. I think it's more, has more stronger aroma and flavor than the Italian basil. Which is why it has a wider and uh, rounder leaf than the Thai basil. 
and that's that's the end of this update see you next time